Hi right, friends, today we see the installation of uh, Linux distribution CentOS OS graphical user interface. Uh, first of all, open the virtual box and uh, configure space everything. Cent OS GUI path. I'll give my D drive. I'll give to GBF RAM. Create and I'll give 20 GB since GUI version. Create now go to settings in systems tick mark this networks in networks connect to bridge adapter and in Prometheus mode hello all okay now double click on this icon CentOS start it will take a nearly 30 minutes or so I'm going with the default language continue I'm going with the default time see since we are installed in graphical user interface so I'm going with server with GUI you can see here server with GUI and uh, if anything unselected please select so everything is got selected and finally network and host enable this see we can see this IP address done now begin the installation I set the password create user I'm making as administrator It took almost uh, 25 to 30 minutes and we reboot the machine now. Accept the agreement. Now finish configurations. Now login. This is our CentOS VM. This is our home page. So we are setting our language. Okay. Minimize this. I'm just I want to re resize this icon. And for Windows we have desktop and this is our home bar. Like recycle bin we have trash now we will log into command lines first of all click on these applications so then they will go to terminal see now we can ask what is our current dark directory see it is like home directory home and it what is my uh, ip address i will see here and we also see whether we have a, we are able to access internet or not this is yeah we are able to access internet also and applications we see whether we are able to access internet or not we will see yeah see we are able to browse now uh, we try to access it with putty if we are unable to access it once you, you can go here you avoid connections you can see 
it was turned off i will turn it on again connect see i am able to connect now once i will check re verify my ip address otherwise we can also check with to get only ip address hostname slash capital i we'll check another check we'll check with this ip 192.168.1.17 yeah see we are good to go with it see earlier we logged in with uh, you uh, with the username we created username but we log in with now root user okay password wrong okay now i'm able to log in now we again we can check what is our present working directory by default when i'm logged in with root user so i was in the root directory but there is also when you create a new user it will be there in whatever whatever the username you have created when you log in it will be you will be available in that location for example uh, now i'll go to root this is the root actually this symbol indicates that this is the root ls minus ltrh so these are the files we have see there is also another root with the directory name root under this main root these are all the fold, subfolders here there whenever you create a user it will go to this home folder here actually where if we create a user and i'll see what are the folders this user we have created so we are that user is present here we'll go to this user so these are the files desktop documents downloads music picture these things will be there since we are installed with gui version these are these these will be available if we have done minimal install these files will not be there empty this will be empty only see here we are going to gui since we logged in with a user by default our location will be see home dot user if you log in with root it will be like this user press right control to come out of this see here by default this you can look into here when you log since i'm logged in with root user my login directory will be in the root this is how now friends okay friends now we got we are able to access internet and also we are able to connect if you are unable to access putty try just to go to this connection see this tree like structure and if void connection make it on see, that's it okay friends we will see more about this in our further videos thank you